Since 1939, MIG has been one of the great names in the defense industry. They're here today at the Paris Air Show, and we're going to talk to Anastasia to find out what the company is doing. Anastasia, tell us about your latest model. We came here to the air show with our uh, uh, best products yet. Uh, this is MiG-35 and the modernized uh, versions of MiG-29, that is MiG-29K, MiG-29KUB and MiG-29-2M. So with the MiG-35, how is that progressing? As you know, we presented MiG-35 early this year in January and now it's undergoing state tests. Uh, according to Russia's defense ministry, all the testing is going good and according to the schedule. And we're planning to finish those tests by the end of this year, beginning next year, and thus start serial production even in the next year. Now MiG-35 is going to be an extension for the MiG-29. You have 29 customers with the MiG-29. Do you see new customers coming for the new 35? Of course, as you rightly said, MiG-29s are being used in 29 countries and they are the main customers we are looking at, but MiGs in whole, the whole family of MiGs are being used in 56 countries. So this is a broader market that we are looking at. And we can start real deliveries even in 2020. So 2020 they're going to be delivered. At that time, what's MiG when he's looking at? What's the next big job? We are working on three different directions. One is a, a perspective plane. Uh, another one is a long distance interceptor plane. And of course, as everyone else, we are working on uh, uh, unmanned flying vehicles. Thank you. Hopefully, we'll be able to see the MiG-35 flying at an air show soon.